Hey, how's it going guys? So earlier today, SkyMill Studios released a trailer for their upcoming Kickstarter project called Kindred Fates. This game is an action-adventure open-world monster collection game, and since monster collection games are a huge focus of this channel, I figured we'd look into the trailer. I'm planning on doing a second video going over all of the Kickstarter information, but for now I figured we'd start hyping up the game and spreading the words, because this game does look quite promising. So with all of that being said, let's jump right into the trailer. Right off the bat, you can see that this game functions in real time unlike other creature collection games, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. I do think that this kind of gameplay could actually make having different creatures quite interesting. Think about how diverse the weapons and armor sets are in a game like Dark Souls. Now imagine if you can completely change your species. That's the sort of vibe I'm getting here and with this system. The visuals are actually quite impressive for a small indie title. Obviously not up to par with current generation games, but that is to be expected. The only complaint I could uh, see having any headway is that the monsters do look a little mechanical. But once again, this is basically like pre-alpha footage, so I do get it. So this game features some type of branched evolution, which is pretty cool. As you can see here, you end up absorbing enemy monsters' souls and bringing them to this. So I really like this concept, actually being able to use your monsters in this way adds a huge level of realism to the world. Instead of just jumping on my creature and insta-teleporting or just watching my avatar push a boulder by himself, it actually uh, allows you to use the monsters themselves to clear obstacles. <laughs> He's always welcome and encouraged in these type of games and it makes me happy that it is something that they have. The only thing I'm wondering is that since it's not confirmed to be an MMO, are you just going to summon people into your world much like you would in a game like Dark Souls? Sorry to keep bringing up Dark Souls, but this game does give me those type of vibes. Maybe it's just the Bond formed prompt, but I don't know, that's just me. So this restless fog seems to be some sort of curse driving the monsters mad. And if you die, you lose your souls. So we're going to change the name of this game to Kindred Souls, guys.
Dialogue choices are another welcome addition in any type of game like this, and the relationship that this game is going to set up with your partner is going to add an extra dynamic to the game that we generally don't see in monster collection titles. Usually the tamer or trainer is completely safe from the consequences of the other monsters, but in this case, it's quite the opposite. It's more of a balanced partnership rather than a master subject or person and pet dynamic we're used to. there you have it guys kindred fates is currently accepting donations to their kickstarter and already has raised $21,000 towards the $65,000 goal these figures are of course canadian so i guess if you were to look at it, the american side of things it would be a little bit lower than that there are still 29 days left to donate and i recommend if you want to see this game succeed to give it a chance i'm sure the devs would appreciate even one dollar from anyone who has anything to spare I'll leave a link to the Kickstarter and this trailer in the description below for anyone that's interested. So with all that being said guys, I do like the direction this game is going and I'm very excited to cover it moving forward. So make sure to like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter at GymLeaderEd, and until next time, peace.